Facets e-depreciation data import, importing data from an external source. The data import module allows you to import data from an external data source including Excel, comma delimited, or fixed length text files. The import feature allows you to map each field in your data source to a corresponding field in Bassett's e depreciation. Adjusting accumulated depreciation allows you to move forward with e depreciation while retaining the prior accumulated depreciation amounts that have been booked to your general ledger at the close of the last accounting period. On the main menu under Activities, select Import Data to activate the Data Import form. The Select File tab allows you to select the following. Click the Open Dialog button to select the source data file. Click First row has column headers to tell the import to use the spreadsheet's column headings. File type is Excel. Action is Append Assets. Schedule is Book. Now select Preview Data button to proceed to the Preview Data tab. The Preview Data tab will display data from the selected source file. You can view the rows and columns of the file about to be processed. The user should then select the Map Fields button to proceed to the Map Fields tab. The Map Fields tab allows you to map the data columns of the source data file to the appropriate data fields in the Bassett's e-depreciation software. You can select a defined map from the Select Existing Field Map drop-down list. In this example, we will use Sample Import. For each import column, you can select a data field from the associated drop-down list. Once all of the required source data fields have been mapped, you should select the Validate button. The system will respond with a message that the map has been saved and will proceed to the Run Import tab. The Run Import tab is the last step in the process of importing data into Bassett's e-depreciation. Bassett's will confirm how many records are about to be processed and clicking on the Process Import button will start the conversion. When the import is complete, you can run a mass recalc to update depreciation for each of the new assets. Now that your data has been imported, the new assets are available for asset maintenance and reporting. If you have any questions or would like to see a full demonstration of e-depreciation, go to Bassets.net and click on the Contact Us link.